going on guys and gals the Captain Kirk here and as you can see we're going to be playing South Park the Stick of Truth it's an RPG turn-based play style game and as far as I know it has all your favorite South Park characters in it uh, when I first heard about this game I was excited and curious to see how they were going to take the show and actually make it into a video game because it seems like most of the time when they take uh, shows and turn them into games they really don't look a lot like the show like, I don't know, for like example, Spongebob games or something like that. I don't know, that's the only one I've really seen. Avatar, you know, Last Airbender or something, I don't know. Something like that. But, um, uh, I can say this show looks, or this game, I should say, looks a lot like the show. Uh, it looks exactly like the show. And you'll probably even forget that you're playing a video game. But anyways, I'll shut up and, uh, let's get to it. of Zaran. The humans of Koopa Keep struggle to stay alive as they are attacked by the wicked drow elves of Larnia. Darkness falls as the humans beg their king to save them, a noble king known only as the Grand Wizard. For a thousand years the battle has been waged, with only the bravery of the Grand Wizard to protect his human followers. But even though the Wizard King is so undeniably cool, the drow elf armies continue their attacks. They seek the human's most treasured relic, the Stick of Truth. But the tides of war soon change, as news of a new kid spreads throughout the land. In order to save the humans, the Grand Wizard must get to the new kid, before the Drow Elves can manipulate his man, and use him to take the sacred relic from human hands. For whomever controls the stick, controls the universe. South Park and the Stick of Truth. Okay, so I guess we're going to create our own character. Let me go ahead and pick... Uh, I'm not near that light-skinned. Not dark-skinned either, real tan. Uh, let's go ahead and pick this one. Uh, let's see if I can't find a hairstyle that... Let's see... Close here. Uh, I want a shirt with a skull on it. Look like a badass. Uh, let me go ahead and get. Go ahead and pick this one. Of course, I'm gonna make the t-shirt orange, favorite color, of course. And then, let's see, make the pants blue. Look like blue jeans. Yeah, that looks. That looks cool. What one is this? Oh, yeah. I have zits all over my face. I'm going to have a black eye. Make it look like I got my ass beat. Which will probably look like that a couple of times after battle. Freckles. Band-Aid and Scar. That's pretty cool. And I think that's either mud or somebody has thrown shit on me. That's pretty cool. Scar. Teardrop. Look like I've been in prison. I think I'm just going to go ahead and go with the regular face. And I don't really... Th no, I'm not going to really go with glasses. So yeah, that's good. Enter in South Park. I'm guessing this is my house that's sold. Moving. <laughs> well, I think that's everything. We did it, hun. We're really moved in. It's a new beginning for us. Things are finally going to be good. Do you really think it will be better for him? They won't look for him here. We just need to make sure he doesn't attract any attention. Come on, let's see how he's doing. Sweetie, hon, you all dressed? 
I hope so. Hey, champ. How do you like your new room? I know it's a big change for all of us, but, son, do you remember why we moved to this quiet little mountain town? He doesn't remember. He doesn't remember at all. That's good. That's good he doesn't remember. Uh, sweetie, we want you to have lots of fun here. Why don't you go out and make some friends? Right. Get outside and play, son. Like, like normal kids. We've got some money for you on the kitchen counter, sweetie. Just be back before it gets dark. Yeah, we love you, too. I gotta say, that orange skull t-shirt looks pretty badass. Could've made it better, it's probably a skull. Or, I mean, skull shit. A scar on the eye or something, but... Didn't want all that. Uh, what is this? Toy chest. Uh, oh, this is, I guess, where you store your inventory. Storage. Let's see what's in this closet. Ooh, cash. Nice. And a baseball card. Let's go ahead and go out. What is it? The hallway, I guess? Yeah. What's... What? And apparently we're in the bathroom. And I'm gonna assume, I'm guessing that all the... Yeah, the yellow handled knobs or whatever you want to call them. Handles, knobs on drawers. I'm guessing that means you can open them up. And apparently you can take a crap on here. That's kind of funny. Shit nugget. That's hilarious. Let's see if we can take a shower. Yeah, let's just stand in there with our clothes on. Let's get out of there. Let's go. I've already checked that room there. Uh, let's go ahead and... Looks like we're heading down... Yep, we're heading downstairs. Hello, Dad. Come on, son. Get out there. Make friends. Kind of persistent, ain't he? He wants me to make friends. Just taking everything in the house with me, I guess. Where's this money? Ooh, I black paint. I guess this is the money. Oh, wow. I hope $2. Thanks, Mom. Appreciate it. Go on outside, sweetie. It wasn't a request, it was a command. Now get out there and make some friends. Oh wow, okay. Looks like we're going outside. Let's see what happens if you try to go back inside. Will you go out and be a kid for Christ's sake? Oh, okay, yep, so, so we are definitely stuck out here now. Let's see what this says, go ahead. New quest, new kid in town, go outside and find some kids to make friends with. Alright. And this garage door. Surfer wig, cash. Fuck you, snowman. Get you in the balls. Alright, apparently that doesn't do nothing to him. You shall die by my warhammer, Drow Elf! Uh-uh! I banish them to the forest realm! That way, I banish you first! Uh, hey, no fair! That's cheating! I'm gonna tell my mom! Thanks, kid! I didn't realize he had a health potion. But my name is Butters the Merciful. I'm a paladin. I live right next door to you. We should be friends. And Butters, I guess, is my new friend. First friend. Hey everybody, there's a new kid playing with us. Me and him are friends. Huh, <laughs> that's that's funny. 
Now that we're friends, you should speak with the Wizard King. He's been talking about your arrival. The wizard lives this way, in the greenhouse, over there. Hey, where are you from? Where'd you live before moving here? You like Colorado? I'm guessing we're going to see the Wizard King. All hail the Grand Wizard! The Grand so Wizard. you are the new kid. Your coming was foretold by a Coldwell banker. I am the Wizard King. But the time for talk is not now. Let me show you my kingdom. We're getting to go see the kingdom now. Oh, who's your new friend, Eric? Shut up, Mom. Not now. Evil Cartman's goatee. Ooh, Cartman's garage key. We can steal some more stuff out of his garage, apparently. Don't talk to her. She's not part of the game. Ha, <laughs> that's funny. Let's go ahead and turn this TV off. Welcome to the kingdom of Koopa Keep. Our weapon shop here is tended by Clyde, a level 14 warrior. Here you can see our massive stables, overseen by the level 9 ranger, Scott Malkinson, who has the power of diabetes. That's funny. And here, of course, is the breathtaking and lovely Princess Kinney, the fairest maiden in all the kingdom. Don't ask why Kinney wanted to be a chick, it's just how he seems to be rolling right now. And Kenny's a, gor a girl, apparently. The Clyde. You may have heard of my deeds at the Battle of Stark's Pod. That's the line the Grand Wizard gave me. My loyalty is as incurable as my diabetes. So, uh, let's go ahead and talk to Kenny, too. <laughs> New quest, Flower for Princess. Okay. You have been sought out, new kid, because humans everywhere are in great danger. I need something from you, and in return, I am prepared to allow you into my kingdom. I know you are very excited. It's time for your first quest, but first, please tell us thy name. Oh, I guess I get to pick my name. Well, it's the Captain Kirk, but let's go ahead and go with Kirk. You entered douchebag, is that correct? Douchebag. Uh, no. Are you sure you want to keep the name douchebag? Kind of have a feeling that I'm going to be stuck with douchebag, but I'm going to go ahead and say no anyways. Very well, douchebag. You will now choose a class. Fighter, mage, thief, or Jew. Yeah. Yeah, I guess... I guess I really didn't have much choice on that. Let's see, it's a fighter. A mage is like a wizard, only not as cool. Mage. You look sneaky enough to be a thief. Thief. Jew, huh? Jew. So I guess we'll never really be friends. You look sneaky. A mage is like a, a fighter um, has courage, honor, and the ability to kick fucking ass. Let's see. Mage looks A mage is like a wizard, cool. only not as cool. You thief look sneaky enough cool to be a thief. Too. Um... I'm gonna go ahead and go with mage. A mage is like a wizard, only not as cool. We welcome to our kingdom, Douchebag the Mage. Hooray! Now please, go and visit the weapon shop. Procure yourself a weapon and we shall teach you to fight. Find a flower for Kenny and buy weapons for Clyde. Let me go ahead and pull up. Let's see what that quest said about Kenny. Princess Kenny desires a flower. Perhaps one can be found somewhere in color. Sounds like a pretty easy one. I hadn't searched over here yet. And I'm guessing that's the flower they're probably talking about. Quest item, yeah. Let's go up this ladder. Oh, that's... Behold, the distant realm of downtown. That's Home awesome. Of merchant lords and homeless See all of downtown South Park from up here. That's really cool. But don't let it bother you that there's a game to be played. <laughs> Let's go ahead and give this flower back to Kenny. <laughs> it's completed. Let's go ahead and talk to Clyde and see what kind of weapons I can buy here. Would you like to see my wares, weary traveler? 
Perhaps you would like to hear tips and rumors for $2? Uh, no, I'm already broke. I don't need to spend any more. See if $10.94, I don't You kids thinking... checked out everything in my backyard. Hardcore gamer. Wow. Yeah, apparently this is all I can get. It's a magic wand for $2.34. Ah, a lovely purchase. Any kind of equipment? No. Flare? No. Okay, so yep, that's the only thing I can get. Go ahead and equip it. There we go. Ah, you have procured a weapon. Nice. It's now time to teach you how to fight. I want you to take your new weapon and, with the bravery of a noble knight, beat up Clyde. What? Kick Clyde's ass, new kid. what I do? I'm the king, Clyde, and the king wishes to be amused. Go on, new kid, kick his ass. Oh, so it's my first real battle, I guess. Here we go. I'm gonna kick your ass. Clyde, you have to wait your turn. That's lame. No, Clyde, it's like olden times. You have to wait your turn. Like in the Middle Ages, Clyde. I know it's lame, Clyde, but that's how we're fucking doing it. All right, douchebag, bash Clyde's face in. Don't be shy. Weapon flashes, press A to attack, okay? Oh, hell yeah, Clyde's your bitch! Alright, Clyde's wearing armor. In order to hurt him, I want you to hit Clyde as hard as you can. Alright. So press X for a power attack. Alright. Ah! Nice. Oh shit, dude, I think I see blood! Fucking nice, bruh. It's exactly what you do to guys with armor like that. Okay, listen up. The key to surviving in battle is not to get hit in the bows. Clyde, it's your turn to attack. Juice back, protect your bows. Prepare yourself. Critical hit. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Dude, you're already nice. way better than Clyde. I'm already way better than Clyde, that's funny. All right, it's time to use your heroic powers. Using your ability takes power points, or PP for short. <laughs> PP. <laughs> if you have a fucking better name for them, then fucking say it, Clyde. Fucking asshole. I'm the king, and I say it's PP. Douchebag, use your major ability to make Clyde pay for insulting the king. That's funny, PP. Dragon spread. Come on, fight! Ah! Oh, that is badass. Oh, and now Wait he's burning. Smile off his stupid face, douchebag. Now do it one more time. Finish him. That what? Is... I was going easy. Take this. That is awesome. Ah! Didn't count. Oh shit. Oh. I completely fucked that up. Ah! ah messed that up too. Ah, well, he died anyways. He, he burnt to death, so we're good. <laughs> Dude, that was awesome! You were all like, beam, and Cloud was all like, nah, nah. <laughs> okay, okay. You proved yourself worthy, Juice Bag. Now come inside the war tent and I shall let you see the relic. So I guess we gotta go inside to see the relic. Well, here it is. The reason why humans and elves are locked in a never-ending war. The relic for which human and elf are willing to die. The Stick of Truth. Oh, about the Just stick. Just two days ago, we took the stick back from the elves. Our kingdom was dying, but now it thrives. For whoever controls the stick, controls the universe. Don't gaze at it too long, for its power is too much for mere mortals to look at. Now that you have seen the Stick of Truth, let's discuss your dues. Being a member of my kingdom costs $9.95 for the first week, $4 of which is tax deductible. Alarm! 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 Someone has sounded the alarm! 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 What is it? The elves are attacking! Oh my god! Defensive position! Oh, that's funny, orc. Screaming his head off, wasn't he? What's this over here? South Park map. Alright. Let's go ahead and go outside and see what's going on out there. Man the gate! Don't let them through! Give us the stick, humans! Fuck you, Drow Elf! Come and get it! Clyde, guard the stick of truth while we defend the fortress! Aye, aye! Aye, aye! We're not playing pirates, Clyde! Juicebag, this is your chance to prove yourself. Hold off the asshole elves at all costs! Fuck you, asshole! Funny. Go ahead and help Butters first. Well, that's not Butters. this. Getting to my first real, real battle here with the elves. 
Do it, douchebag. Kick these elves' asses. There's two of them. Fuck you! Oh. You're wounded, douchebag. Potions will heal you. Here. Go ahead and use this potion. Nice, nice. We'll say you can have one potion every turn. I asked for five, but this was counterman. This guy's fast, douchebag. Try to block all his attacks. Okay, if you block all the attacks, you get a counterattack. Look at your enemy on the ground. Weak and helpless. Kick the shit out of him. There we go. Nice. Awesome, you kicked his helpless ass. Now finish off these elves in the name of the Wizard King. All right. Go ahead and use a power attack on... Yeah, let's go ahead and power attack this guy. Uh. Nice. Nice. Ah. Bring it on. Right in the ass. Say another power attack will probably do on this guy. Uh, and great job, yeah, he's bag. definitely dead. Alright. Oh, just pick up with this guy. I got you back! He's gonna beat the crap out of that kid. And there's two again. You got this, douchebag. <laughs> what are you waiting for, douchebag? That guy's just standing there. Go kick his ass. Let's go do a power attack. What the hell? <laughs> oh man, he was totally waiting for you, dude. You can't just hit him like that. Ah, uh, okay. I got it. You need to try a different tactic to damage him. Look at that archer hiding behind his friend like a wood. Switch to your arrows, douchebag. Snipe that little bitch. Bow of sucking. Sweet, now you can hit the guy in the back. Go for the pink mist. Wait, whose turn is it? Uh, power attack. Oh, nice. That's what you get from Let's fucking with the his ass. In your face. Bring it on, dude. Careful, douchebag. That guy's ready for your arrows now. You gotta try something else. Uh, let's see. Use my abilities. Dragon's breath. Who's Come on, fight! Oh, that is badass. Great job, douchebag. Bring a firecracker to him. That's what it looks like. Roman torch, whatever the hell they call them. It's pretty sick. Fight! Fight to the last man! Seriously, you guys! He's over beating the crap out of a cat. <laughs> oh, it's on! So just this one, I guess. No, there's two of them. Let's do this, douchebag. Alright. Come on, bring it. And that guy's gonna block. Oh, he's got a shield. Okay, that guy has a shield. Shields are super weak. Just hit them with your simplest hit over and over to wear them down quickly. All right. Nope. Gotcha. Oh, yeah, that was awesome. Right. The other elf let his guard down. Now's your chance. Power attack his armor. Okay, let me power attack this guy. That's cool. All right. Stop it. Oh. Now, now finish him. Now. Nice. Power attack him again. And he's down to two. Nice. One more hit. You did. That was awesome. God. What? The stick of truth. The elves got it. That was your one goddamn job, Clyde! To guard the stick of fucking truth! Clyde, you are hereby banished from space and time! What? No! 
You can't do that. Yeah, I can. You're banished and lost in time and space. Yeah, go home, Clyde. You fought bravely on the battlefield, douchebag. Yeah, <laughs> if you can make me a douchebag, like you sure can fight. Shut up, Scott. Nobody cares what you think. Anyways, we have a bigger problem now. The stick of truth has been stolen, and we must assemble our entire army in order to get it back. But our three best warriors still haven't reported for duty, my king. Our newest member can take care of that. Douchebag, I want you to go out into the neighborhood and find my greatest warriors, Token, Tweak, and Craig. I'm texting their pictures to your personal inventory device now. But beware. The lands outside are full of marauding drow elves, monsters, and sixth graders. Be sure you're well equipped. Now go, and send my warriors here. Fighters, go with him. So, the new kid in town's quest completed. Let's see here, calling the banners. We can use a new friend. Okay. Let's see if I can get anything yes, I'm here. Now. You need any weapons or armor? I don't think I'm going to be able to afford to get anything. I can get a few things here. Uh, let's go ahead and get a couple of small potions. A couple Good of choice. vibe potions, I guess. Oh, let's go let's ahead. See what got. Yeah, let's go ahead and sell some stuff. Get rid of all this. Pretty good work here. I mean, oh, they got all kinds of weapons I can buy. Um, let's see, tassel made from increases by three times your armor value. Uh, let's see. Don't see anything good that I can buy right now. I'm not high enough level. Equipment. Clyde's helmet. Looks like that's all. Oh, let's go ahead and get this too. I guess this is a fast travel. Yeah, fast travel spot. Okay. Alright. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and stop here, but when we pick up next time, we'll be going to find Token, Tweak, and Craig. Go ahead and hit that uh, subscribe and like buttons and until next time guys and gals peace